Hello and welcome to Bootham Crescent, the home of York City Football Club. Today's visitors are Ketchum Town in the Vanarama National League North. My name is Rob Spurn and I'm delighted that you're able to join me for this match. And so we are off. After a 15 minute delay to kick off following uh, Ketchum Town encountering some uh, travel difficulties. But, uh, what we go the other end again, here's Alan O'Connor taking on Joe Tate. Gets the shot away, it's deflected behind by McNulty. And we have the first corner of the game. Bow knotted on, finds Maguire, and he's played it through to Kerr Willoughby. The flag stays down, but White came out of the goal. He's pretty much all on his own, but now he's joined by Marcus Kelly and T went for the shot. It's blocked, it comes out wide, it comes back to NT, gets another shot away this time. It's a long way off target and it ends up into the David Long on the stand. Down Catherine's right hand side finds Daniel T. Gets the ball into the box, tries to find Kelly. Catherine have a corner. Kelly just missing the chance there. Milnes with the corner. Headed out by McNulty. Comes back out to Milnes. Cross back in. Jameson flaps at it. And the goal has been chalked off. Referee deemed that there was a foul on Peter Jameson there. Protestation is from many Kettering players. Jameson tried to take it quickly, but the uh, referee has pulled it back while he tries to deal with the protestations from uh, well, led by Alan O'Connor. That's the first man. This time he heads it back on. Maguire chests it down. Tries to find Ferguson with the pass. Ferguson keeps it in. First time cross towards the far post. And uh, Boa there seems to have come off. And the ball is right where York City wants it. Well, exactly well. Except they would quite like it in the back of the net at some point. Griffiths manages to find space for the cross. And it comes in from Willoughby. And comes. Uh, but the offside flag goes up against Dan Maguire. He's denied his third, third goal of the season. Well, the cross came in from Callum Griffiths. Okay. Green, that's a good first touch. Gets the shot away. And that shot nearly came to Kurt Willoughby. He might have been in an offside position. Being a lot more productive in this second half. McLaughlin. This is good nimble passing play. McLaughlin looks for his options. Tries to find Ferguson, gets the cross in. Burrow's there. And Jordan Burrow makes the deadlock after 63 minutes on the clock. Ferguson it was who found him with the low cross and inside the six yard box was the danger man Jordan Polo to score his 14th goal of the season. It's York City 1, Ketchum Town 0. Well, the productivity of York City just hasn't stopped in the second half. They go ahead deservedly so. Got the shot away, but it was well saved by by White. Uh, Law finds and T. Tries to win it. Comes out wide and it's scrambled. It's a huge goal now. Scrambled. Jameson takes it off the line. No goal given. Excellent work from Peter Jameson. There was the shot from Ben Mills. Flank that the goal came. Ferguson once again creating like he has done so many times this season. Meanwhile, the ball played through. O'Connor, the flag stays down. It's O'Connor. That is a super save from Jameson. Over. Played into the box once again. Burrows there to head it away. It comes out to Colin Griffiths. Just anywhere will do. And now Willoughby has a chase on here with White. White coming a long way out of his box. Ah! 
We've now had the five minutes of added time. Anything else is just the referee's bonus. And there is the full-time whistle. York City get the win.